She's bleeding and it's pretty bad cut, so we have to probably get stitches. For real, John, this is bad instructions. Oh my god! I still remember. Say good morning. Say good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. We are hanging out. John took the girls to gymnastics. Addie decided she wanted to hang home with me. Last week we took her just to let her watch and Everly was a monster so we decided we wouldn't be taking Ev anymore. And then I asked Adeline last week if she wanted to participate and she didn't so then this week I was like, do you wanna go and watch them again? She said, no, I wanna stay in with you. Um, and I didn't even give that as an option so I was like, all right, that's fine. So me and Marin and Addie are hanging out in the office because I just got this big box. If you look around the floor, we've got a storage problem. We don't have enough space. We have like this, we've never really done an office tour, but we have this storage cabinet, which has like a camera gear, hard drives, stuff like that in it. And then we've got this one over here um, that has a bunch of my oil mailers and just like oil supplies. It's got a filing cabinet at the bottom for all our papers. Then we've got, then we've got these two big open shelves, which you can obviously only keep so much on. And I have my little station right here with paper, like mailing, office supplies, and then extra oils and things like that. We still have a bunch of stuff on the floor that we don't have space for. So I bought something to replace that cabinet right there. I'm really excited about it, but it looks like a beast <laughs> to put together. It's still all in the box. So, and then there's some stuff there. I'm gonna get it all out, start building. Um, gymnastics is almost over actually, so we'll see how much I get done before all the crazies get home. For real, John, this is bad instructions. to know why our kids are so loud. Are your kids loud? Like, our kids are so loud. And I'm already, I'm a soft-spoken person. Too much noise overwhelms me and kind of like, makes me frazzled. John is a very loud-spoken person. I can't help it. And I'm just like, trying to figure out how we can train our children to be more like, just kidding, but be quieter. Tyler, your sister is sleeping. Please well, Tyler quiet. says like, always she's like, I don't know how loud I'm being. Like with Tyler, everything is fast paced, over the top, excitement, silly, whatever. Everything she does is big and wild. Raise your hand, drop an emoji. If you're like me, where like too much noise is like, ah, like. And Elena is the same way. So Elena gets so frustrated. I think half of her meltdowns come from sensory overload, just from like too much noise. True. Because she does, when she goes and retreats to a quiet place for a while, she's fine, she'll reset. But like when she's just, in it, I feel the same way. It makes me nuts. Hey, Graham, you got something for Judy? There's a surprise for you. Something oh, that you, you did? probably forgot all about. Be careful. Careful, it's, it's breakable, okay? You know what it is? Oh, that's cool. It's got money in it. Oh, I just put some money in it. I didn't. What is it? Funny. It's like they put a little in there. Awesome! Thank you, little thing. She went and got your bank. Can and I be, see it? Be very careful because it'll break. And look on the back. Oh, I see it. That's cool. <laughs> and this means Judy. Let's see. Oh, yeah, it says Judy. Uh, what do you no, say? You I say thank you for bringing that? Say thank you for bringing that. Give me money. Say thank you for bringing that. Thank you. 
You are welcome. I got to put some money in it too for I leave, cool. okay? Yeah, they went um, a couple weeks ago and made that together just on a day that Jude was home from school. So Graham and Pickin picked her up and took her to the pottery place and they did that. And so um, Graham finally picked it up because we mm -hmm. hadn't had a chance to, so. You love it? Be careful, it's breakable. Yeah, let's keep it away from little hands so that it doesn't get broken, okay? Well, Jude just dropped the thing she got. She broke. And broke it. She's and she's bleeding. She's bleeding and it's a pretty bad cut. So we have to probably get stitches. So that's how a normal day turns into a crazy day. I'm good, I'm good. Look at that. Oh, I need the black oil. I just heard her trip and heard it crash. And I ran over there just to make sure she didn't get step in it or anything. And I picked her up. She was screaming, I thought just because she broke it, but then I looked and saw her hand was just covered in blood already, so. Here, don't you smell this, it's gonna make you breathe. Hold on, let me get some out. There we go, it's beautiful. We're gonna go to the hospital. They're gonna have to look at your hand, buddy. Eddie. All right, they're gonna sew it up. Come on. Sew it up, me. Like stitches, remember when Addie got stitches in her, in her eyebrow? Yeah, it's gonna be okay. It'll be all You're right. gonna be so brave. Mommy and Daddy are gonna be with you. But we gotta do that because I looked at your boo boo. Listen, I looked at it and it's really Alan. deep, okay? It's not gonna stop bleeding by itself. John, just grab her if you have to because Marin's crying. We really need to go. You hold it tight? It was breakable though. Hold it tight? Oh no! It's okay. It's okay. It's just a little blood. What? Blood. It's okay. If it's gonna be anybody's blood, I'm glad it's your blood. Yeah. That did not come out the nicest. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, I'm in it too. So what happened? How did it end up? And um, I was walking and. I accidentally slipped and fell, and then it broke, then it caught my. Oh, and you! It, it broke in your hands. No, I. I, I, I think she tripped and, and it crashed, it, and she landed where it crashed. No, like, actually. Like it broke as she was. No, actually, yeah. on top of actually, yeah. I was at. She was in the garage walking. Um, and she was like back behind where the trampoline is, and so she tripped on something. Of course she did, because there's nowhere to walk in there. I know, well, she shouldn't have been in there in the first place, and then I shouldn't, I saw her with it when I was, I was going to take the recycling down, I saw her holding it in the garage, and so as I dumped the recycling, I just heard crash, and so I ran up there, and as I was picking her up, I just saw blood all over her hand. It's right over there. See? That one? Uh-huh. Like the one where this, this is going up? Yep. You ready to go in? That's scary. I'm sorry, buddy. You're going to be okay. This is a place to be, okay? It's not as bad, but then I saw how deep it actually is. Well, luckily, they're not very busy today, so that's good. I mean, there's like two other people in here, so. I don't think that means they'll be any faster. It's just a place to come and get more sick than you are, but for things like this, like. Gotta go. Let's do, let's see if they can glue it. You want to have stitches? What do they do when they do stitches? I just don't know. But you just want to do stitches instead of the glue? Mm -hmm. I think it would be better if they can glue it. No. Okay, well, we'll see what they say, but if they say glue, 
it'll, it'll be good. You'll be see stitches. It'll be okay. So you're gonna get a wristband. What's that mean? Like you get a little wristband, like a bracelet. Like a bracelet. Like a bracelet. Yeah. Isn't that cool? I want balloon. A balloon? No, it's white. A blue or a balloon? What do you think? A balloon. A blue? What? We could probably get a balloon after this. Like yeah, we'll a balloon. You, yeah, we'll get you a balloon after this. Okay? Okay. Hey, you're supposed what to stay in a seat. Six, eight, or ten. How much does it hurt? Mm, ten. <laughs> ten. <laughs> Maybe three. Maybe it's a three. Yeah, it wants to four. It wants to four. To four? Yeah. Okay. That's what it hurts a little more. Okay. They have to give you a shot in it to make it numb. And then they have to like take a needle and sew it up. What's the needle? I sew it up. Me. Like a needle, like a sharp little needle, and then they, they poke a hole. And yeah, what he's gonna do is gonna just be like a band aid, essentially. He's just gonna stick stuff on there. It's gonna help it stay together so it doesn't hurt. Okay. It'll hurt more if you do the stitches, is what we're saying. So you wanna do stitches that's gonna hurt more, or do the sticky stuff that's not gonna hurt? Sticky stuff that's not gonna It might hurt a little bit, but not very much at all. Okay, the stitches, he's going to have to poke well, your skin. Well, it, it wouldn't hurt because... Yeah, it's not going to hurt the, from the... It's just going to hurt if he's touching it. Numbing it would hurt. Well, yeah. That's scary. This is not going to be scary. It's not going to hurt. So, we're not going to so do stitches, which is great. They're going to clean it and then do, like, the stera... What do you call it? Stera strips? So... There's that. You're all right, buddy. You're my brave girl. You Look, girls can change the world. That means that you're brave and you can change the world. No, I can't. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. God can only change the world because he ha he's powerful. He's powerful than anybody, even Who mom is? and dad. God. Yeah, God can change the world, right? I'll make sure that your finger works because it might have cut too deep. And then your finger, that's what he was doing. He wanted to make sure you Yeah, they're making sure that you say that. stuff on it. No. Now they're going to put another bandage no. on it to make sure That's it blood. Now I know why it straight. doesn't heal no, as nice as well. why? when it's not stitches because it's not even, it didn't even like pull it together. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. it's going to have a big scar where it's remodeled. So scary. We probably should have gone with this time. Dude, um, look at that. That's awesome. Jude has a robot hand. I can, uh, uh, I can move these fingers, but not this one. Yeah. What do you think? Is that cool or not cool? Judy was so brave. You did great, Judy. We're so proud of you. <laughs> I, was really the tape. <laughs> yeah. was, I was really scared out the water part where we water our hand. That was stained. I'm sorry, buddy. But you did great. Look, it's over now, right? Mm -hmm. Now we can go home and enjoy the rest of our day, right? Let's go. Okay, we're going. Let's go, okay. Are you gonna walk? How's your hand feeling now? It wasn't bad, but I still have to not use it. No piano lessons, <laughs> or no basketball. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Two things to do all the time. She doesn't do so either one of those things. No, 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 ba no basketball, no piano lessons, okay? Okay. Why are you saying that? Because he can't lose this here. Yeah, but you don't even play basketball or play the piano. She's so funny. Wait, um, I could use piano lessons because he could still do. Oh, yeah. I guess she could still do piano lessons. <laughs> We're back, Graham. 
Just a little metal thing that helps keep her finger straight. Which if she can't, her finger won't stay straight? Well, she has to keep it from moving a whole lot because it could have damaged her finger, so they have to make sure that it doesn't damage her I finger. Look at this kid. What are you doing? What have you been doing while we're gone? Alright, so we're back home, kids. Are back home um, between my mom and our neighbor, Melissa. They've survived. The day only got slightly out of hand. Um, I did not finish my desk uh, thing, cabinet thing, or even really close to it. I'm gonna try to finish now. We finally got everyone settled into bed. So Jude is doing okay. She was actually eating an apple upstairs earlier and tripped and fell. And so of course, with the apple in her hand, she used her other hand to catch herself. Um, it was bleeding like a tiny little bit. I checked on it, but I think it's gonna be okay. So of course this morning John was complaining that Vlogging on Saturdays was gonna be really boring because we're all like exhausted from long weeks And how it was just gonna be the same thing every week and just like mundane and boring Thanks a lot John for saying that without knocking on wood because our happy little Saturday turned um, Chaotic we just shuffled everyone up for quick baths in bed Jude was like, she did, poor girl, didn't even eat much of her food. She was just ready to go to bed. She said, I just want to rest. I just want to rest. And I know it's because the crying, like just the trauma of the day, I think completely exhausted her on top of being exhausted because we went to the zoo yesterday. Um, so much. Anyway, I'm going to try to finish this desk now. So wish me luck. Uh, maybe I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done, if I get it finished. But I have a feeling somebody wants my attention. If I don't see you guys later, love y'all. And um, thanks for staying with us. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we will see you next time.